<laughs> oh. We're in Darda tonight. Ooh, I haven't seen him for a while. Oh yeah, I love this jacket. You know, <laughs> since I was a kid, Gary's, Gary's been the one constant in my entire life. And he, he changed me. And it's easy to see why. He provides you with a double shot of charisma and resonance like no drug could. Yeah, I feel good. I feel good. I, uh, I attribute to about 35 to 40 percent of action I've pretty much ever had to Gary. Travels, anyone? No, thanks. Hit me. Yeah, since then, I've had a bit of a spell with the ladies, but uh, I'm hoping Gary can pull me through. No drinking cab. Drive. The disrespect. I will remember your faces. You're on camera. You're on camera. Come on, hurry up. Sorry about my friend, he's had a couple of drinks. But he'll keep quiet for the remainder of the trip. Do you mind if I put the radio on? That brunette bird of fire is sending a little clad, my way, boys. Jerry's already working. Clad? I see. Hey, that's Jane from my work. Jane! Hi! How are you? Good, how are you? Not too bad. Um, this is Val and Heidi. Guys, this is Jane. Hey, Jane, nice to meet you. Would you like a beer? Oh, I can't drink beer. I'm absolutely intolerant. Sakahito, it is then. Please, <laughs> excuse me, boys. I just. I need a pat on my nose. Wish I had Gary. I'm afraid to say Gary's a one man jacket. You might be able to borrow my, uh, my beige one, Ralphie, but uh, <laughs> Gary's just for me. Jeez, I'm razzed. I'd love to ride from this bird. Hey, the Bishop of Albert Albert. Nice to hear about it. Astonish me with this, uh, this theory. Yours, that somehow deviates from me and this girl populating each other's time sheets. I don't know, maybe I'm just a good and tolerant and tolerant. Georgia, sorry. Did we get Georgia? It's Miss Bell. We can get Georgia. Okay, it's alright. We'll just do it again. Yeah. Keep rolling. Jeez, I'm razzed. I'd love to ride from this bird. I hate to push your bubble with Alba. I'd stick there, but I'd stick clear of G.I. Jane. Astonish me, mate, with your theory that somehow deviates from her and I populating each other's time sheets. G.I. Jane, judge, I'm going to say G.I. Jane. Sorry, G.I. Jane, so hot. Alright, we got it? Yeah, I thought it was different. Alright. Alright. Jeez, I'm razzed. I'd love to rifle this bird. I hate to push your bubble with Alba. I'd stick clear of this. G.I. Jane. Astonish me with your theory, mate, that somehow deviates from her and I populating each other's time sheets. G.I. Yeah, gluten intolerant, Jane. I don't know, I guess I'm just really gluten intolerant and intolerant. I need to have to worry about that stuff, though. Mm -hmm. I can still hear that. I heard a rumor that this girl, every time she has sex, listens to the special show about Mr. Well, hopefully Valley V hears that tune tonight. <laughs> I just like to find out whether she's one of the ones that talks. Amongst themselves, about whether she has to tell the whole world about it. I don't know what you mean. What's that about? Just a bit of a bland combo. I'm sorry. Why is it so close to your heart now? I went terrible at some Growing up as a kid, I just. I'm oh, sorry. Alright, we're going to go from start to finish. This is going to be one long scene. I oh, know. Because no, no, no. we we're keeping this the exact same. But point of reference. Sorry, cut, mate. Action. Jeez, I'm razz, boys. I'd love to rifle this bird. Hate to burst your bubble, Val, but I'd stay clear of G.I. Jane. Mate, astonish me with this theory that somehow deviates from her and I populating each other's time sheets. G.I. Jane? Gluten intolerant, Jane. I guess I'm really gluten intolerant and intolerant. I don't have to worry about that. It's not hard. <laughs> Funny story, though. I heard a story. Rumor, rather. But every time she has sex, she listens to the special two by Mr. Higgins. Well, hopefully Valley V hears that tune tonight then. 
I just like to work out whether she's one of the ones that can talk to others within her group about it, or whether she wants to tell the whole world about it. Yeah. What do you mean? What's day one? Conversation with it. What's the sequence to your heart man? Is that one or time? What's the sequence to your heart man? Well, growing up I had terrible sinuses. And, you know, I tried all the special bakeries and did all that sort of stuff and went without gluten for a while and then I just thought, I'm not going to let this thing beat me. It's not Anyway. It's like the labyrinth. Anyone who tried to go through it had a hell of a time. Unfortunately, you instead of going up by occasionally. <laughs> Maybe his crystal ball is what's causing the said blockage. Remember, kid from high school, we put the lyrics yeah. to dance magic dance. No, love some. How'd you sleep, Bok? Pretty well, thanks. Catch was a little lumpy, but okay, you know. Yeah, we've been meaning to get down to IKEA to pick up a new one. Maybe get us a discount, Bok. Uh, hon, I have to Jane home. Can I borrow a car? Sure. Thanks, my brother. Welcome, mate. How long do we have the pleasure of this stain? He's as displeasing as those shitful, tasteless pancakes. Ease up, Belle. He'll be alright once you get to know him. He'll only be here a couple of days. What happened to all the toilet paper? I don't know. You know I've only been reading Shantram on the clock. Belle? Haven't touched a mate, been a bit constipated. Have some just drop. What if there was any fobbing milk left? I see what's happened here. I think Jane used it all. Because girls use toilet paper when they do ones. Also, I bet that Bjorn used some when he Made sweet, sweet love and wrapped a condom last night. How many shits do you suppose girls use when they do number ones? I've often wondered that actually. I reckon I'd say eight squares. Yeah, I'd say four lots of two. Yeah, eight squares. Throwing a poo every now and then, you're going through a roll at a prolific rate. It's alright, lads. I'll, uh, I'll grab some when I go down to the shop to get some milk and bread. It's okay. I'll just have a shower. Plus, I like the cut of the bone. We'll make it a quick one, mate, because I've got to get one out as well. Mate, you can't. We've got no crap out. It's going to be a clean one. How do you know? Just, I've always been able to sense it. The sixth sense. Do you want to grab? Thanks. Uh, I think I'm going to walk down to the store to get some sushi. Does anyone want anything? No, thanks, Jane. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, yeah, actually, a box of, a box of beers would be great. Yeah. Might need your muscles for that, Bjorn. <laughs> Yo, how the case, mate? Pick up. Thanks again, my brother. You're welcome. Uh, might as well get some bread and things. I'll get two loaves so you can freeze one. We'll make other sandwiches. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. What are you doing? What? Why the fuck do you keep leaning this oxygen and for the car, mate? Yo. Yes. I've got no relationship with him. As long as I think I'm in my room, it's my only anxiety. So would you. What's Jane's big concern with whether one loaf should be frozen and one should be left out for sandwiches? Seriously, he walks in here and he takes over the place like an 8th century Swedish Viking. It's like all the Svensson. She sits around watching her Will and Grace DVDs all day long. It doesn't even annoy you. Him calling you my, him calling you my brother. Or... It's the girl that worries me. I can't do a boot with a girl in the house. I suppose they are messing up the lounge a little bit. They're Deborah messing up my lounge. It's the sound. It's going to plop a reverberate. It has to be postponed. Where'd this thing come from, anyway? 
Uh, we uh, swiped that on the way home the other night. <laughs> Mate, don't worry about the sound. Just play one of these ABBA CDs to mask the sound. It's good on you. Get ice. Compress. Oh Compress. God. What else is in rice? Rest, ice, compression, elevation. Do rice. Oh, I think I'm Do you want to do rice? What? Are you okay? So, uh, where are the beers? How could you ask that right now? What? I'm injured! Discuss the correlation. You're so insensitive. That may be, but I still don't see what your being injured has to do with me being thirsty. Will and Grace, baby. Great test. <laughs> Decorum, please. Yeah, sorry guys, I'm not myself at the moment. What's we happening? Oh, it's that Borg, using our place as a campground. Alamon's wrecked you know, he just walks in and dumps his stuff down wherever he pleases. Alamans Retin. Maybe it's a Swedish thing, I don't know. It is. Discuss. Especially this law in Sweden. Alamans Retin. It means you can wander around people's property and use this campground. No, it's not. It is. The culture treasures Alamans Retin. Well, I don't treasure it. I loathe and give no reverence to Alamans Retin. Alamans Retin. Get some respite. Cocktails. On you. All right. I got you. I'll just do some cleaning up, mate. No worries. Hey Val. Hello. How long do you think the grace period is for someone staying on your couch? Oh, I'd say about a week. Mm. I'd say ten days. That way you've gone over and above, you know. But you can still tell them to ship off. Yeah, it's fair enough. Golo Bjorn doesn't get that though, mate. The stain doesn't even take off his shoes when he comes into the house. Hey guys. Hi, Hi guys. Hi. Good night. Yeah, good. Yeah. Would you like some cocktails? Yeah, why not? Sure. Ah, uh, but uh, looks like you're going to have to share. This is the last straw. Mm -hmm. Hey, Val. I don't think that was the last straw, mate. This is. Somebody's been sleeping in my bed! Hey Val, I don't think that was the last straw, mate. This is... Draw. Bjorn, I don't suppose you were sleeping in my bed this afternoon, were you? Uh, yeah, we had a nap in there earlier. I didn't think you would mind, my brother. I think I've got bed bugs. I've had enough of your Alan and Stratton. Helmut's right. You've used me? You've used Party? You've used Han in his bed? You used a knife for peanut butter and you didn't even clean it afterwards? You've used the term my brother far too often? But worst of all, you used Gary. Get him off. Put your shoes on. Get him off. Take your shoes off. Walk to the door. Put your shoes back on and fuck off! I'm sorry, my brother. Keep the Will and Grace DVDs, you filthy animal. 